Hello everyone! Are you frustrated with tomatoes getting eaten up with insect pests? Don't worry! Let's talk about some common insect pests of tomatoes today. But before we get into the pests, let's talk about some tomato facts. Tomato plants have five growth stages, seedling, vegetative, flowering, fruit formation, and mature fruiting. Seedling and fruiting stages are most vulnerable to insect attack. They must be protected. Insect pests have two types of mouth parts. Chewing mouth parts, like in beetles and caterpillars. Piercing and sucking mouth parts, like in leaf-footed bugs. Now you are ready to be an insect detective. Let's talk about some early season insect pests of tomatoes. Flea beetles chew small round holes all over the leaves and can kill small tomato transplants. Thrips have piercing sucking mouth parts. Their feeding causes leaf deformation and virus transmission. Aphids are teardrop shaped insects that suck plant sap and produce honeydew resulting in sooty mold which is a fungus. Look for these insects under the leaves and control before they increase rapidly. Have you ever wondered what causes those leaves to be missing and the fruits with holes? Those are caused by caterpillars. Here are some common caterpillars. Beet armyworms have green, plump body with a pair of black spots behind the head. Fall armyworms have a V-shaped mark on head and dark body. Yellow striped armyworms have a dark body also with yellow stripes on the sides and black triangular markings. Southern armyworms have a dark body and reddish brown head. They have long white stripes broken up by dark spots. Remember, armyworm eggs are laid in masses like this. Look for egg masses on soft terminal leaves. Continuing some more caterpillars. Fruitworms make nice round holes with head dug inside the fruit. Hornworms have a harmless horn on their abdomen. They feed on leaves, stems or entire fruits. Loopers like this one have missing legs, so they move in a looping manner. These are often late season pests in Alabama. They lay single eggs scattered on plant terminals. Look for early feeding injury on leaves. Can you tell what these are? These are the adult and larva of the Colorado potato beetle. These are major defoliators of plants in gardens. They are also infamous for insecticide resistance. Let's talk about insects that cause quality loss. Brown sting bugs have piercing sucking mouth parts. Feeding causes extensive fluid fruit discoloration. Leaf red bugs have leaf-like expansion on their hind legs. They aggregate in large numbers on fruits. Sting bug and leaf foot bugs cause discolored, distasting fruits that rot, rot fast on storage. And finally, let's talk about some occasional pests. White flies feed on plant sap staying under side of leaves. They look like dust particles or dust cloud when they are disturbed. Spider mites are not insects. They increase in dry weather or with insecticide overuse. Look for them under the leaves. Remember these final details. Scout every week or moved more often for both pests and beneficial insects. Look for insect 
over and under the leaves and also plant bases. Here are some integrated pest management tactics. Plant and harvest timely. Maintain healthy plants, get good variety. Use pest exclusion fabric on netting to stop insects. Use conventional or organic insecticides if needed. Watch our other IPM videos in the Bringing Farmer playlist for detailed control measures. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to download and install the Farming Basics phone app for contacting extension for pest pictures and more. Install today.